fresh Swedish game studio Shark Mob has revealed their first project in the cult classic, Supernatural Universe with a new vampire, the Masquerade Battle Royale game. Quietly announced on Twitter and their website, Shark Mob has teased that a currently untitled chapter of the hugely popular vampire series is in development as a Fortnite-style shooter. Touted as a thrilling take on a cult classic IP, the short trailer does indeed show an exciting range of gameplay set in a beautifully dark world in the same style as the upcoming vampire, The Masquerade Bloodlines. According to the game's description, the action takes place in Prague where various vampire clans are at war with each other. Players will be able to play solo or in teams against each other while also looking out for the ominously named entity. The entity apparently wants to destroy all vampires in the city and I'm guessing this will be similar to Fortnite's Storm. Vampiric abilities as well as traditional weapons can be used in combat as you battle to survive until the sun comes up. This promising title is just one of a handful of games set in the Vampire universe that is scheduled for release, the most anticipated of course being Vampire, the Masquerade Bloodlines which has been delayed yet again. However, more games in the World of Darkness series are scheduled for release over the next year. While most of them aren't AAA developments like Bloodlines, they serve to expand the stories of the main games and shed some light on the goings-on of the series. Coteries of New York, for example, is a narrative-driven visual novel that allows the player to make choices that affect the unfolding tale. While not a 3D AAA title, it does give a broad insight into vampire clan rivalries in the series' ecology. There are many clans in the series such as the Bruja, Camarilla and Nosferatu, all of whom have their own agendas and belief systems. Other new games in the Vampire series include Vampire, The Masquerade Shadows of New York, which is a direct sequel to Coteries, and Vampire, The Masquerade Night Road which is a text-based browser game. Of course, the Vampire series is only part of the World of Darkness which also includes games based on Hunter, The Reckoning and Werewolf, The Apocalypse, the latter of which has upcoming AAA titles also. Given that this is Shark Mob's first development, it is a very big responsibility to create a AAA game based on such a beloved series. However, I don't believe that such a responsibility would have just been handed out to anybody so I have every confidence in Shark Mob's ability to pull this off. If the final game lives up to the extremely intense action promised in the very polished and stylish trailer, then this is one battle royale game I might just take the time to play, not being a fan of the genre myself. Also, Shark Mob has the chance to cement themselves as a main player in the video games and indeed battle royale industry so I look forward to seeing what they ultimately end up creating. Currently, all we know about the release date of the new Vampire Battle Royale game is that it is scheduled for the second half of next year.